Hello ladies and gents, it's Hagbard Selene here, and I took last week off because, frankly, I was feeling uninspired and I had a lot going on. And then, someone sent me a video. And for the sake of clarity, because if I break in every once in a while, you're never going to be able to follow the conversation if you're even going to be able to follow it when I present it in its entirety. However, at the end, we will discuss what this whole incident was about. And I'd ask you while you're watching this to ask yourself the uncomfortable question. Do you think she earned her place on this campus? So, what was the cause of this uproar? Well, it's an attempt to de-seat the current student president, because a couple years ago, it appears, he made the archaic blood symbol, where you spell out blood with your fingers. And this is culturally insensitive. Mind you, as someone that grew up with some knowledge of these people, uh, the blood symbol, as portrayed in these particular instances hasn't been used since 1992. I'm saying when Kurt Cobain died, that symbol was already old. Nobody uses that shit. So what we're learning now is that this person has absolutely no problem with owning that gang culture apparently is just black culture. That's, that's what this activist, quote unquote, is doing. And the manner in which they choose to do this is it's the manner that they always choose to do it. They bum rush in, and they emotionally assault people. They just run in and scream, and clap, and dance around, and accomplish absolutely nothing. This is a laughable, laughable behavior for anybody on a college campus. And it wouldn't be accepted out of anybody else. And we all know that. When we see something like this, everybody that sees it knows that your behavior would not be acceptable if you filled any other niche on campus, let's say, if you weren't a minority woman. Even if you were a minority man, this behavior would probably be deemed unacceptable, because men are scary and threatening. However, you can shout and scream and clap and demean and just talk shit, and nobody's ever going to stop you, and you know that. And yet you're the one that has the balls to talk about privilege. If we honestly don't recognize, understand, and enforce that this kind of behavior is unacceptable at the university level, it must be unacceptable at the university level, we are looking at having no progress in the future for quite a large amount of time, I fear. That's it for me, ladies and gents. As I said, I'm feeling somewhat uninspired as of late, however, I'm releasing a short, funny video just after this one that's probably going to piss a few people off, so sorry about that. That's it for me. As usual, stay safe, good luck, and goodbye.